check it out guys i'm on my day bed um i'm gonna call this a rock and roll bed and it's gonna upset people because it doesn't really rock or roll um but the reason i'm calling it that is because i'm using the theory of the three cushions that that create uh, a sofa and then those same three cushions create the whole bed um so it was a rock and roll bed that gave me the inspiration but i haven't got the weight allowance for a mechanism um, or any framework and it would also make it too high by the doorway um so yeah I'm literally sat on two large cushions and I've got a smaller cushion at the back. Um, I haven't got any throw cushions or anything to make it comfy yet. Um, even though it is comfy in its own right. Loads of fl floor space. Um, using my shelf, drinking my coffee. So, yeah. I will... You're currently sat where my sleeping bag is. I'm going to hopefully pull all this out, show you how quick it is. I don't know what the camera angle is going to do for you. But... So you literally and there we have it uh, the black and red is a small gesture to the the pattern of the interior of the defender a full double bed it's almost 1900 in length and 1400 wide which is about just over six foot by five foot i believe so to create the the couch again that goes there and that's with one hand while holding the camera and there we have it just somewhere to retreat during the day um if the awning's not out or it's too cold to sit outside or you fancy just watching a film you know but look at all the floor space that it that it leaves for us. Just makes this space so much more usable than it was when we were trying to chill out on an airbed. It's just not much fun. So I am really, really chuffed with how it's coming along. Very simple. The simplest solution. The hardest part is going to find someone to make them because all the guys on eBay uh, that make all of these custom rock and roll beds and cushions and things like that, they're not interested. So I managed to find a guy near me. Um, very fairly priced. It's four inches of foam. Um, with It's actually vinyl, not leather. Uh, the, vi uh, the vinyl is just as strong. Um, and leather is far too expensive for what this is. But, you know, having a dog in here and, you know, you might have muddy trousers, wet trousers. It's just wipe downable as opposed to going for like a fabric or something like that. Um, I also want to show you that the back of these cushions, he's actually put a waterproof material. Um, it was it was the upholsterer's idea. But this this material here is is waterproof. Um, so, you know, these can be used outside. You know, you, we can, if it's a nice day, we can, we can use them as cushions for outside. It's just that little bit, little bit more usability and versatility. So yeah, the inside is coming along quite lovely.